this video we will learn about coefficient of variation. To understand this concept you should know the difference between higher quantity and consistency. Let me explain you this with an example. Consider you have two friends. One friend can sit for hours and study. Sometimes he can study all night. But on some days he doesn't study at all. Maybe in a week he studies more than 40 hours. There are weeks he doesn't study at all. Your another friend doesn't like to lose sleep and prefer healthy lifestyle. He may not sit and study all night but he studies every day for 5 hours. If you take a sample of one week you may observe your first friend had studied 40 hours and second friend studied for 35 hours. If you take sample of another week you observe your first friend have not studied at all but your second friend had maintained the same routine and studied for 35 hours. This is consistency. Statistics is all about studying and analyzing the data. Use of statistics is you can derive some useful information and can make some decisions based on the data. Coefficient of variation of data provides you the parameter which determines the consistency. The definition of coefficient of variation is the coefficient of variation is a relative measure of dispersion. It is based on arithmetic mean and standard deviation of a frequency distribution. It is also called as relative standard deviation. Coefficient of variation CV is equal to standard deviation by arithmetic mean into 100. Coefficient of variation sometimes shortly referred as CV. Standard deviation is sigma. Arithmetic mean is x bar. CV is equal to sigma by x bar into 100. CV is determined by standard deviation and arithmetic mean. This is in percentage and hence independent of unit. As I told you, coefficient of variation determines the consistency. More the percentage, less the consistent given data is. Less the value of CV, more the consistency. Let me calculate the coefficient of variation of two set of data. We have data output of two factories which manufacture t-shirts. This data is collected over six days. If you see the mean of these data, you find factory A has larger output. But it doesn't mean factory A is consistent. The standard deviation of factory A and factory B are like this. Let's see what is the coefficient of variation of factory A and factory B. Coefficient of variation of factory A is more than factory B. Coefficient of variation of factory B has smaller value compared to factory A. What it means is factory B is more consistent in giving output. Some wholesale dealers prefer consistency in delivery. In such case, they should prefer factory B over factory A. As coefficient of variation of factory B is lesser than factory A. If the supplier is looking for only quantity, then supplier should prefer factory A compared to factory B.